Shocking to load shells. Last one. That shotgun. Out of shells. Oh, bloody dare you. episode. Gosh, I hate when I do that. Three shells left. I'm out. 
put two in at a time. Alright. certainly look at what my gun allows. Laser sight for the shotgun's pretty good, but I'm hardly using the shotgun. Oh, look at this. Fire a second shot at me, they have to first. I don't need that. Thank you. You wanna kill that girl? She's super low. Be nice and enticing. Yeah, I know. Any help, boys? Nice job, gents. I'm kill leader. Hey, eight shotgun. and nothing else. I don't need that. That's pretty good. Grenade, grenade launcher sounds fun, but uh. circuit. Oh. Oh. Are you serious? Alex! Really? That killed me? I could kind of do this all day. Dang it. Ah. <laughs> Need a break. It doesn't tell me where to go. Drops at me. I'd never survive a jump from this height. No, 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 absolutely not. Why? Were you considering it?
Oh, hey, I can wear that. Instead of fling barrels and stuff at the player. That'd make him have a lot of fun. Make him friggin' Got to scout it out. You guys aren't going to be able to see anything.
this. Four shells left. Dropped a bunch of bullets. I really need to focus. Come on. That's an empty shell. It's really dark. Russ? Yeah? Can you just talk? About what? About anything. Literally anything. Well, I think that given our situation, your irrational fear of the dark is actually quite appropriate. You know, I can give you easily a hundred reasons to be terrified. Okay, that was my fault. I'll be more specific next time. Big fan of this flashlight. Not unlike yourself, is also sensitive to the dark. Oh yeah? Meaning it should go on automatically when the lights go out. Oh. Nice. Love when that happens. The other side of where I was. Yeah, it is. So what? Now I have a flashlight. That's a multi-tool. <laughs> Just grab at it a little bit. Box is covered. Here you are. Three more. Alright, easy. Alright, Russ. Really need you to talk again. Absolutely. Be specific. Um, before. What was life like before the combine? Ah. Have you ever heard of a club sandwich? Uh, nope. Not once. Right. To make a club sandwich, you need to start with bread. Not from a bread line, from a bakery across the street. Baked that day, okay? You add tomatoes, lettuce, not vegetable paste, fresh. Then you add bacon. That's from an animal we used to call the pig. You toast the bread and you put all that inside it. You guys had all that? That's insane. It is. And I'm not done. Then you add a second sandwich on top of the first one. You put ham in it, also from a pig, and turkey from an animal we used to call the turkey. And more tomato, more lettuce, and a bunch of other things I'm forgetting. It was six inches tall and weighed a pound, and had a dozen ingredients from five different continents. It was the most impossible food item you could imagine in any age before ours. Wow. I know, right? That is... Wow. Thanks, Russ. You're welcome, Alex. That's awesome. 
You're lucky, bub. Time has come. Thank you. Sacrifice will not be forgotten. Good luck. Right, so I'm certainly gonna jump out of me here. Thanks. Every corner. 